Hi, I'm Myra Ferguson for Jar Productions, and in this video, I'd like to show you how to identify and clear style overrides and why clearing overrides can help your N5 output. When you enter text in an InDesign layout, InDesign applies the default character style and paragraph style to your text. It also applies the default object style to your text frame. When you make any changes, you can create a style that you can then reapply within the document. For example, you could make a header that is a particular font and size, create a style, and then apply it to other headers. One of the benefits of styles is that when you update the style, it updates everywhere that style is applied. Styles are also what N5 uses to create the CSS for your HTML5 content. These styles can make the export of your content with live text go faster, although exporting text as images is the fastest way to export text and the best way to make sure that your output matches your layout. You can get unexpected results or even slow down your export if you make changes to a style without either redefining it or creating a new style. That's because you've created what is known as an override. If you export with N5 and text rendering is set to images, style overrides shouldn't be an issue. It's when you export with text rendering set to either of the HTML text options that N5 uses the character, paragraph, and object styles to create the CSS. If there are overrides, then N5 goes through a series of checks to try to guess what the style should be. These checks are what can slow down the export, especially if N5 has to make a lot of guesses, which can dramatically affect long documents and N5 may not always be able to guess what style you had in mind. You can see if there are style overrides in your document by going to the Character Styles panel menu or the Paragraph Styles panel menu and selecting Toggle Style Override Highlighter. Or you can click the Style Override Highlighter button in the panel. When that option is enabled, any text that is formatted with a style override is highlighted in cyan. When you select the highlighted text, you can see which style is applied. Styles with overrides will display a plus sign to the right of the style name in its style panel. You have several options for addressing the overrides. You could create a new style from the override. You can click the plus button at the bottom of the panel to create a new style and then apply it to the selected text. If you don't mind changing the other text where the style is applied without the override, you can redefine the style by going to the panel menu. If you didn't mean to change the style, you could clear the override in the panel menu and have the style that's applied to the text revert back to the original style without the override. And there's also a script that you can use to clear overrides. Go to Window, Utilities, Scripts. And in the Scripts panel, go to Community, Clear Style Overrides.jsx, and then run the script. So if you'd like to export with HTML text and the HTML text styles aren't rendering as expected, or if you'd like to speed up your export, make sure to clear any style overrides. Thanks for watching. If you found this video helpful, please give it a like and be sure to check out N5 at n5.us. Thanks so much for watching.